Oh god. Do I do I still know how this all works? It's been a while since I last played. Ah, uh, let's just hope for the best. Apparently we're up to version 1.0.1.5F. To pay respects. Uh, I think there's been like three major updates since I last played, so I left off when I defeated the She Office. And now there's more. Let's hit continue. I didn't really do any grinding in between, however I did recruit some people. Which you're gonna see here. Ah, oh, oh, it feels good to hear this again. Uh, in Kater, we now have realism. If you can't remember realism, neither could I until I saw her name again and then it all came back to me. It was like I had some mental blockage. But it seems like I have that quite a lot, so it's nothing unusual. In Chazet's team, we have Basil and Evangeline. Well, all of these armors are subject to change because I think we're about to get some new stuff with some new invitations, hopefully. Um, Basil and Evangeline with Chazet. In Gabura's floor, we have Pansy and An Anastasia. Anastasia um, created as Anastasia, actually, so I didn't really have to do much. But we had one in Lobotomy Corporation Season 1, so I thought, why not keep her like that? And give her back her old hairstyle and stuff. And Pansy. <laughs> One of the best names, really. God, I love it so much. Uh, Tipper's floor is still the same. Natsek's floor is still the same, I think. Hot's floor. Jesus, wait a second. Here we go, that's better, Hot. You look like a little boy for a second. I mean, not, not to shame you or anything. Flat is justice, but... It's weird. Um... And yes, that's floor. Anything new here? No. <laughs> G Galina still looking like a carnival freak. And on Marcus' floor. Oh, I missed Harry. <laughs> I missed him. <laughs> so it's been like one, two weeks since the last place or something. I don't know. I've re recorded a lot of stuff in a short amount of time. In like one and a half weeks or something. I recorded like ten episodes, I think. Um, maybe maybe a little bit less. And then I stopped since I hit the end of the updates, as you will be able to see, or as you were able to see at the end of last episode. So now that we have some new content, I will most likely record two to three new episodes so I get up to par, and then wait a little bit again, and that's how we're gonna do it. Uh, I do wonder if we will ever catch up on YouTube, though. <laughs> tell me what day it is when you... Wait, that doesn't work, right? Uh, anyway, tell me what day it is that you're watching this right now. <laughs> it won't help me at all, but... For your sake, today is the 12th of August, um, so you know how much I'm pre-recording this right now. Anything, okay, anything to do. We have an abnormality battle at Tipperest floor with Tipperest Park and Cooper. Invitation-wise, we have... What was that again? Oh, that was the puppets, right? That was the puppets, yeah, that's uh, the, the circus. I think I, I did this once more and then I got Emma's card. Uh, she? I, I haven't done this after we've beaten it. We did beat it, right? Yeah, I think we did. We, yeah, we must have. We have Eugene's card, if I remember correctly. And that that's new! Book of Sayo and Book of Kurokuma Clan. You know what, let's... Let's start with the abnormality battle first. Um, will you enter the Book of the Night of Despair? Oh yeah, okay. I've got, I've got spoiled a little bit. I knew that it would be the Night of Despair. Let's try. Tipperiff, Park and Cooper famously not very good at what they're doing. Her blessing was pretty sweet to have. Oh shit. It goes away when you hover over it. You don't need to click it anymore. And that's new. Um, a knight whose pride turned into despair. Okay. Nothing was truly upheld on my watch. Please don't wake me up. I wish to rest in peace. <laughs> that's me. Let's see. The knight of despair. Her passive abilities. Loyal protection cannot be targeted. Does not act. 450 HP, what the crap? Sorrow gives tears to a random sword every three scenes if the character is staggered activates the scene after. Despair, when a sword with tears takes lethal damage falls into despair next scene. Blessing of despair, when the abnormality falls into despair all swords fully recover HP and here we go and stagger resist. When the abnormality falls into despair, all sorts fully recover HP and stagger resist. And use special combat pages. So we don't want that, do we? A broken heart. If all sorts impale the abnormality in despair state, become staggered and targetable next scene. Oh, so we do want it. I'm getting conf this. Oh shit, is this gonna be the whole episode? <laughs> Already I think that this is gonna be too complicated for me to beat on first try, definitely. Okay, and the sorts themselves, they all have the same 
passive. So it's TS, gain a speed die, use special pages, and change resistance while under the effect of TS. Respite, enter a state of suspension upon taking lethal damage, revives after two scenes, and Sword that pierces despair. If this fails to deal any damage to its target while in despair state, the Sword will impale the Knight of Despair, dealing damage to her. So we need to do that. If this fails to deal any damage while in despair state, and it gets to despair state by being reduced to... When a sword with tears takes lethal damage, falls into despair next scene. With tears takes... We can zoom in. Okay, I never really used that. Um, so this one has tears. That's tears, right? It doesn't say anything, but I, I assume it is. Okay. Sword laced with grief, 2 to 9, 3 to 6. This die deals damage equal to dice value times 2% of target's max HP ignores resistances. The crap. Percentage damage? In my card game? On hit, inflict fragile. Wait a second. If this fails to deal any damage to its target while in despair state, it's not in despair state right now, is it? It's in tier state. Tears. Gain a speed die, use special pages, and change resistance while under the effect of tears. It's weak to pierce. Oh, shit. It's only weak to pierce. Did I change? Do we still have pierce stuff? I think we do. Oh, God. I, I don't think we can beat this with one speed die pages. But... We will try, at least. We will definitely... Oh, good lord. Fucking try. Okay, I'm sorry, Cooper, but you might get stabbed quite a lot here. Hmm. Now, let's let's just see what happens, okay? Oh. Oh. Hey, the, no the number changed. Oh, yeah, there's been some updates to the UI as well. Oh god, this feels like... <laughs> every time I play this for for a while and then not play it after a while and then play it again, it feels like a different game, really. Some patches do change up quite a lot, which is beautiful, to be honest. It's, it's amazing. So do I focus on this one? Do I... can I just... Well, Tipper only has slash pages, apparently. It's not good. It's not good at all. <laughs> Shit. Uh, let's take this over, who cares? Ah. Oh. oh, lordy lord. Wait, this is one slash and then PS. Would it be better to do it now? It wouldn't, would it? I mean, can we still win the clash? Still, I mean... My phone also just... I think I just received the message. Okay, maybe we won't do, do this abnormality battle today. Maybe it's better if I just do the the story encounters first, okay? Shall we, like... Do we need? Do we even need to press floor? Oh, okay, maybe the abnormality pages can. Turn it all around. Um, all characters become fatally vulnerable to all attacks for three scenes. Hmm... Would this be a smart play? Uh, after winning a clash using an offensive die, a random ally recovers 3 to 5 HP. After winning a clash using a defensive die, stagger resist. The enemy who dealt the most damage to allies in a previous scene is marked as a villain. Deal more damage when attacking the villain. Oh, I can't tell whether I like these cards or whether they're absolute dog shit. Who do I... Oh, we're all crap! We're dog shit! It's not, it's not the abnormality cards, it's us! Fuck this! Um. Ah, oh, what do I do? I need a, I need another deck for this. I need to think about this one. Sorry, Night of Despair will be next episode, most likely. I, I know already. I know already that we won't be able to do it like that. Uh, can, we might as well ink over here, but uh, let's take this one over. Sure. Okay, we hit it at least once. I mean, jeez. <laughs> Here we go, another hit. Oh! The ink over. Carrying us. A little bit, at least. 
Oof. All that remains is hollow, weathered pride. Yeah, I get that. <laughs> oh, look, we have some, some PS pages. However, not really useful. Oh, oh, it changed. Now this one is... Holy crap, what? Of course, after three scenes, it changes. Maybe I don't want to focus on the first one. Maybe I want to focus on another one and then hope 50-50% chance. Like, this one starts with the tears. But it can't get the same tears again, can it? So either this one or this one gets it next. If this one had gotten it, we would have staggered it almost immediately. Wait, if it gets tears, does it fully heal up? When he, wait. Give tears to a random sword every three scenes if the character staggered activates a scene after. Oh, there's so many questions here. I don't quite... I mean... However, they definitely want you to use PS damage, apparently. Look at that. So... I'm gonna try this. I don't know. This will be a loss anyway, but... Just to see. Just to get a little bit of a feel for that. And by a little bit of a feel, I mean get spanked hard by this and enjoy it. Oh, <laughs> Cooper fucking died. Um, uh, let's try hate out. Oh, we're staggered anyway. <laughs> oh, we're staggered anyway. Who cares, right? So we take more damage now in this scene. Possibly dying. Am I getting filtered right now? Is this what Comfy feels like? Ah, oh, suppression of the night of despair failed. Well, that's only 15, no, 10 minutes lost of this recording session. That was pretty embarrassing, wasn't it? Let's just try to forget about that for now. And do this one next. Book of Sayo and Book of Kurokumo Clan. Is it gonna be, uh, what's it called? A thumb? Maybe? Ah, oh, no, it's the sweepers! Wait, is that voice acting I hear? <laughs> really? Oh shit, that was the wrong button. No, I, I'm supposed to read all those numbers. Give me a second. I, wait a second. It's not voice acting, is it? We, at least we can't play it back. So we have Anton, Valerie and Lila. Wait, wait a second, that's Lila? <laughs> Lila is huge. <laughs> She's a girl of my taste. Um... I do wonder if these sounds played back or if these numbers mean anything. Can anyone crack the code, please? I'm not... Hell, I'm not smart enough for that. It does sound like a tape recorder being, like, played back and... And, and you know, like, um, scratching a disc and stuff. God, I can't explain myself. I'm, I'm too much in awe of the size of this... Last. <laughs> so am I supposed to read this? Sorry. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> okay. I knew it. It's pretty much impossible to understand the language of sweepers without an interpreter to translate them for you. I mean, what? Are they machines? I thought... Are they machines with a queen? Angela's gonna like that. Wait. I can promptly translate a speech as long as it has the form of a language. Really? Can you speak any language, Angela? Can you speak German? What, seriously? You can make sense out of those few sentences and decode a whole language from them? That seems impressive, actually. It seems... Wait, yeah, she shouldn't be able to know a language language she doesn't know, right? I mean, she can decode, maybe. She can translate it into letters, but... Those letters doesn't necessarily need to make any sense. I'm that capable. <laughs> Look at that smug smile. Okay, here we go. It is becoming clear that the night is no longer ours alone. I know. I know that we have few and fewer places to properly dine at with our families. <gasps> oh no. Don't make me feel for the sweepers. I hear that the families who dine at the Nest of Elkhop are recently having a hard time seeing what is in front of them because of the mist covering the area. I hear that some families even get lost in the fog and fail to leave. Why? Oh fuck, the sweepers named Anton! 
that can't, that can't be right. There can only be one, okay? There can only be one Anton and it's ours. Why are we not letting Mother know? If Mother knows, she will wage an all-out war against the Index. We are not certain enough to risk losing our families to battle. Why do I feel sympathetic towards Sweepers, honestly? More sympathetic than I feel towards some other people, like even the She Office. <laughs> If it is true that the Index truly has betrayed us, and if Mother is too late to realize their treachery... Wait a second, the Index is working with the Sweepers? Or the other way around, the Sweepers are working with the Index? What does this imply? And if Mother is too late to realize their treachery, many of our families will starve, they will slowly die out. Less food means Mother will have difficulty fostering new family members. Sweepers can't be a distortion, right? Because they've been around before. How does the mother make new members? Maybe, okay, maybe it's all a big metaphor. Maybe the mother, the queen of the sweepers, is a machine that creates new sweepers. Maybe, since they seem to be machine languaging and stuff, and they seem very machine-like, um, and this looks like fuel, I assume they turn people into fuel. They also turn people into other sweepers. That's how they reproduce. Their mother is most likely a machine they put people in to make new sweepers out of them. Brainwashing them? I don't know. Are they cyborgs? Are they people? Are they a machine? We need more information. I need to keep reading. People are annoyed if I spend too much time in between sentences. Sorry. We all have our own homes, our own families and our own children. That wouldn't work if they... Would that work if they were machines? I'm not advocating neglect, I'm simply saying that we need to practice caution. What the f... What is... is it's a carnival member, but what is happen happening here? You know that it has only been a week since those despicable filth known as the carnival raided the dens of our brothers and ate our families. Oh yeah, I recently edited the carnival episode. They ate sweepers. I didn't even, like mention that or notice it really when when we read that i think five days ago <gasps> Le de loop invaded my younger sibling stan and brutally killed two families it's um the furry wait did the furry wear the puppeteer's uh jacket before oh man that's confusing three days ago a proxy of the index laid waste on our neighbors is that a proxy? It looks like a machine itself. Two days ago, Puppeteer took my children. And yes... Yeah, so... Oh god, what was her name? Tanya? I think it was Tanya. With, an, with a Y, right? So that's like the, the Russian uh, way to write Tanya, I think. Um, anyway, they're wearing the same thing. The Puppeteer and Tanya. And I think they're both working either for or with the Blue Reverberation. So that might be their little um, gang get up. So yesterday, I know, I know that those incidents all happened at night. I know that our presence is not as powerful as before. I know that we have lost our dominance over the night time of this nest. Mother should be aware as well. We know that we need more space to use as our den. Then why? We will only lose more of our dens if we get involved in bigger conflicts. If we were to engage in a full-fledged battle against the Index, we will have even less time in our hands. We must make it through, on our own. What will we possibly do? It is the library. We must go to the library. Well, what? How, how did they come to this conclusion? Also, all of this out of those few scrap sentences in the beginning? Really, Angela? She's m imagining things. She's making stuff up. Come on. I know that the library has the books of those who worked for the farm in the Index. Have you received its invitation? I have. With this we can confirm if the Index truly has turned its back on Mother and our families. Moreover, this will help us relieve the hardships of our families dining at Nest L. If we are not too late by then, that is... Oh, Anton seems very intimidated. Just like our Anton. <laughs> I understand what you mean, Uncle. Uncle? Wait. Which one? <laughs> Let us call our neighbors. Let us head to the library together. Let us tell our children to lock the doors and not let strangers in before we leave. Were we the monsters all along? Are sweepers nice? I mean, they're killing people. But so are we. 
No, no, wait, we're booking them. We're not killing them. We're doing them a favor, I think. Let us as parents protect our mother, our neighbors, our family and our children with our own hands. Make L Corp or L Nest great again. <laughs> Whoa, are we really getting sweepers as guests here? They have the capacity to collectively go somewhere with a clear purpose at a time that isn't night and talk so fluently? That's funny. I expected them to be a little coarser. I once got an interpreter to try to talk to them before. I thought they could only speak in jumbled words back then. But boy oh boy, look at them using complete sentences. And they're so talkative with each other too. That means the interpreter I paid an arm and a leg for was a total scam and a ripoff. Alright. Suspicion time. Why the fuck did Roland want to know what a sweeper says? Why the fuck did he pay an arm and a leg for a translator to get something out of a sweeper? Are the sweepers all composed of family members? It's probably just a symbolic term they chose to forge bonds between each other. I doubt they're actually families by blood. It's metaphorical, like the titles most other syndicates use. I heard they kidnapped children from the outskirts and the back streets. I don't really suggest looking too deep into sweepers. They're all over the back streets and the outskirts, and I don't think they have much to do with the freedom you're looking for anyway. Angela needs to know about the bad stuff in the world as well, Roland. Just saying. Okay, here we go. Dear neighbors, this is the library. This is the place the scum of the back streets have been rattling on about. We did not expect to come to the library ourselves. Greetings, dear guests. Greetings. Uh, are, are you our family? There's no way I am now, is there? God, she looks angry about that. Maybe she doesn't want to be associated with sweepers, I guess. Angela, are you racist? However, you speak in the language of our family. We can speak with other members of our family. I try to talk to the guests on their level these days, as you can see. <laughs> what do you mean on their level? I'm impressed. This is surprising. Behold, neighbors, the library is not like any other place. I know. This is the first time we are having a real conversation with someone who is not our family. Family, 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 family. Could you stop with that horrid rubbish? Ooh. This feels like the first time that not Angela's triggered, but the guests are gonna be having. <laughs> family is important. It is not horrid. We apologize. We are simply here to take the books we desire. Oh god, no, they're not triggered. <laughs> they're even nicer than before. <laughs> and in regards to the mist covering this nest, do you know anything about it? You'll find out when you read the books, no? That is true. All we want is to acquire the books we want to find. We will be satisfied. Fine. May I find your book in this place? Why is she so annoyed now? What did they do to her? Fuck you, Angela. Or oh, fuck you, sweepers. Free acts! Ooh. We have two floors available, though, so... Obviously, we're gonna start with our top, top-notch floor of Nicole Harry Hunter Markov. Let's take a look. Oh, gold cards! Exclusive combat page. On use, all offensive dice on this page gain. On hit, recover 2 HP. Why do they... Hmm? <laughs> why, why, does, why is this a special effect? Why, it's, why is it not behind the dice, like, written like the on hit down there? If the unmodified die rolls free, recycle this die. What? If it rolls a free, recycle this up to six times? Does this mean... Recycle as in, use it again? Also, exclusive combat page can only be used with specific key pages. Does it need to be used in the sweepers page? Damn, what is this? Free, 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 1973. Gain persistence for four scenes. This page is exhausted on use. Upon taking lethal damage, revive with some HP at an 80% chance. This chance is halved each time the character successfully revives. Wow. Extract fuel, here we go. Night in the back streets. All dice lose two power for this scene. That's not good. <laughs> oh, on use, restore two light. Wow, that's especially good. Okay, let's see. Defensive dice power plus one. When another character dies, recover 20% max HP at the end of that scene. Oh no, I can see what's going on here. All right, we need to focus fire. We need to focus... Oh god, it's five of them. I didn't even notice. 
However, if we just go ham, ham, pan, pan on them. Actually, let's go for... Ooh. Let's go ham, ham, pan, pan on this one. No, let's do this another one. Another way. Um, yeah, whatever. Gonna do this. No, 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 wait, 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 wait. Gonna do this, but at the same time, we're gonna defend against this one, I think? I don't know. I don't know if I should defend at all. So now we're gonna take it over again with Marionette. This sweeper should be dead. They don't have a lot of stagger or um, health. They also don't deal a lot of damage, it seems like. Oh yeah, the recycle seems pretty good. It just hit me several times. Okay, it's staggered now. Down to 23. Down to 50, down to 1, it's gonna be dead at the start of this turn. Here we go. This doesn't even trigger... Ah, oh, recover 20% max HP at the end of that scene. Ah, oh, okay. What does this do? Persistent. Okay, yeah, okay, so... However, it would make sense to focus on this one now. Oh, crap. Can't really use two dice here. But draw one page would be prime, I think. Do we want to focus on another one immediately? Because I think this one will be dead with these three people. Or these two two people and three guys attacking it. Um, so we might as well see if we can maybe... Oh god. Oh god, no. Actually, it's pretty bad. It's pretty bad. <laughs> Let's try to focus on this. Who cares that we're gonna get hit a little bit? Uh oh, are we not gonna kill this one after all? We might not. Crap. I miscalculated. <laughs> that could cost us our first try. Am I recording? Yes I am, I think. Jeez, sorry. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> it's just that sometimes when I have to leave my computer in, in the middle of a recording, I, I tend to forget. <laughs> I tend to forget what I was doing as well. I'm not a smart man. Oh shit, if he restores 20 HP now. 20% even. Okay, let's see. We we have a lot of negative emotions, apparently. All allies except the selected character lose 10 HP? No. For three scenes, recover 50% of max HP? No. Oh god, they're all pretty bad. Okay, who do we want to heal up a little bit? Let's heal up Harry. Sure. We need to hold back a little bit now. We can't get hit a lot. So we're gonna... Go puppet blockade, blockade on this... Oh wait, forceful gesture. That seems pretty good. And we're gonna puppet blockade like this. Just to deal, deal damage and do something. This one should die with all of the two... Uh, with all of the zero cost die, really. Or maybe we're just gonna do this and be get it over with. Uh, yeah, we're gonna crack off Dawn his ass. Are we? No, I'm gonna faint memory. All right, let's see it happen. A faint memory was a bust. However, that was. Good, Harry. Incredibly good. As was this Markov. God, I'm so glad with this team. They're so strong. I love this floor. I love Markov's floor so much. Here we go. Oh, he had the chance to revive, of course. Oh, this is... Oh, this is gonna get annoying. Is this gonna be the rest of the episode? It could be. It very much could be. Let's restore some light instead. Yes, okay. They are taken care of. We're gonna do this here, and we're gonna 
take this over like that. And then... Just gonna do that to help a little bit with killing it. Okay, okay. Good. Great. Let's see if this is gonna be enough. Oh crap, did we just lose the effect on Harry? I forgot that I had it, had it on him. I don't want him to get hit at all. Anyway, this one is dead. You have millennia of combat experience to catch up on, pal, says Nicole. The smuggest of nuggets, really. <laughs> okay, let's see. Do we still have... We still have the fairy's care effect, I think. For free scenes. Abnormality page currently in effect. Okay, so we, we don't really want to take anything over. Which means we're gonna go... Um, Creek and Gigik. Oh no, we have to defend against this. What would be the best? 3 to 7, 3 to 6? 2 to 7, 3 to 8? Uh, let's go for this and this still. Okay. Oh, wait a second. Yeah, no, no. I'm, I'm not going to be able to stagger him before he reaches Harry. Because Harry has a high speed die anyway. Uh, what are we going to do here? He's attacking Nicole. Everyone else is just going to try to focus on, on this one to kill it. Sometimes I like to click this instead of pressing space. I don't know why. I'm weird. That's how I grind usually, since I grind one-handed. Don't ask why. It's because I need to scratch my balls every now and then. I can't do it while recording, since I'm afraid of you hearing it and having some weird-ass ASMR moment. But when I'm not recording, I can scratch myself as much as I want, right? It's not against... I mean, it's not illegal, is it? Scratching yourself? If it is, then I'm a criminal. Oh no, YouTube, please. <laughs> please, it was a joke, I just said that, okay? I'm not really a criminal, YouTube. Not really. Okay, Harry is gonna take everything over. This enemy will die. We can safely focus on this one, I think. With everyone else. Oh no, shit, Harry might get staggered himself. Oh no. He did it successfully so far. He doesn't have a lot of stagger resist left. Ah, oh, but he's he's such a champ. Holy shit. The puppet uh, page 2 or whatever it was. Such a good fucking card. I've taken a look at Emma's page, I think. Is it Emma or Noah? Emma, I think, is the one with the proper page. And it's just not as good. Those passives are so fucking good. I don't know if I hit the lottery with them or something, but they are so strong. Okay, we need to take this over. I don't want Harry to deal with this. Um, oh shit, can we take it over with anyone? Like, yeah, like this, okay. What's going on here? <laughs> Wait a minute. That doesn't seem right. Okay, everyone else will focus on... ...on this. Uh -oh. It's not gonna be enough, apparently. Okay, he didn't get his chance to revive at least. Okay, he's gone now, suddenly. Good. Uh... Yeah, what, what do we do? There's no real point to doing anything, is there? Well, we definitely need to win, so I'm gonna do this. Fuck this. <laughs> oh, why did I not send in everyone at once? Why was I so cocky? Here we go, he's gonna die now, definitely. Good. Good. If he doesn't trigger his effect, that is. Which he did, but we can just keep waiting on him afterwards. So it triggered the effect, but it didn't get any more stagger out? I don't know. It's a little bit weird, to be honest. This should be enough to kill him. Sometimes I'm just lazy. Sometimes I just don't like to cure all of the attacks I could. That's it. Victory on Act 1. At least. Oh, huh, that took a while. And it continues with more sweepers. Okay, this episode will be just sweeper galore. Are they any different? No? We're just gonna continue with these chucklefucks then. 
I still have another floor available. I assume it's gonna be um, like Anton and Lyra and Valentina or whatever she was called in the third act. Okay, again, we're just gonna focus on one of them. We have the light advantage now with us starting at four to five light. So we can just go, as I like to say, ham ham pan pan on these mother truckers. Uh, I'm gonna take this over again with this. All right, just ignore everyone else. We have full stagger. It doesn't matter Go full unga bunga on their asses This one will be dead it Just doesn't know it yet okay, Just use these two here and Maybe a cheeky searing sword while also doing that and now we're gonna take it over again. Here we go, taking all of these attacks, but it doesn't matter. Do they have any debuffs? I, I don't quite know. It doesn't matter, again. If you just do it like that, it's most likely gonna carry you through this fight. If you have the same uh, combat pages as I do, just do the same. <laughs> and you will get carried hard by Harry. And Hunter. And Malkov. And Nicole. It's gonna die. Here we go. It's dead. It, it's set right? Or is it a he or is it a she? I don't know. Here we go. One more. Uh, oh, we're gonna have to take this play of affection on Harry, right? This this is carrying me so hard every time. Predation is not as good. Match light? Add a, oh, wait, this is new. Add a match light page to the hand. Cost one. Roll range damage increases with each use. Has 25% chance to explode on use, starting with the fourth usage. No. Harry is gonna clash as much as possible. He's just our designated clash boy now. Um, we're gonna focus on... They all have persistence now, but we're gonna focus on this one. Harry's gonna take over again in a second. Um, do that. This. Gonna do this this and take it over again with the good old gigik gigik gig i don't know well harry is gonna take a little bit of damage but it doesn't really matter too much so will everyone else really oh he doesn't take any damage since he staggered his enemy oh, he's so good harry i love you so much why are you so good why is this page so good? Why is this abnormality card so good? If getting a negative emotion coin means me getting this abnormality card, then make me sad, please. Make me as sad as possible. I'm gonna start hitting on another enemy right away. With some people, at least. Uh... Actually... Yeah, no. Sorry, sometimes thinking takes up all of my processing power. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. Good. Again, we're gonna get hit, but it doesn't matter as long as we don't get staggered too hard by too many enemies with too many of our nuggets at once. Oh, yeah. Yes! Another one bites the dust. Good, this one is staggered. I think we're just gonna keep focusing on... Look at that! We rolled an 8 speed-wise. That's crazy. Um, yes. Also this. And... This and we're gonna react to this. We're doing that. We're gonna crack of dawn this. We're also doing. Oh no! Oh shit! I'm gonna have to use the crack of dawn here, I think, since I do want to kill him after all. And if I don't send enough people after him, well, we're not gonna kill him, are we? Man, I, I seem to get a lot of bonuses because my numbers are always higher than they seem to be at first. So this must be like... Passive bonuses from the key pages, I guess? 
Oh, he's gonna die to the burn. Or is he? Yes, he is. Was just a matter of whether he will revive or not. We're gonna react here. We're gonna react here. And. Ooh, might as well focus on anyone, really. Doesn't really matter. Also, don't need to do anything here. Can't do anything here, really. Wait a second. Oh. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Gonna take this over like this. And Harry's gonna take this over like this. Here we go, that's better. And we're gonna... We're gonna focus on this one. Whatever. Immediately staggered. Oh no, he hit us once! Whatever will we do? It's a lot of debuffs on this enemy. And dead. Did we just deal 32 damage? Did I see that right? I think we did. Okay, next. There's not a lot to do here still. Just go all out attack on this one. But take it over with Harry since well, he's the strongest of our employees right now. Oh, he's staggered anyway. Doesn't matter. Nothing we do matters at this point. We can only win. Oh, yes. This game truly is too easy. You know, last episode I titled, This game is too easy and people were making fun of me. And people were right for making fun of me because in between this episode and the one I published, there will be a lot <laughs> where, where I do think that this game isn't easy and I do get my ass handed to me a lot. However, right now, I feel like I'm cruising through the game again. Except for, of course, I still remember, yes, I just lost to the Knight of Despair. Okay, you don't need to remind me. Don't type your ang- If you were writing an angry comment right now, send it, yeah? It's, it's understandable that you want to do this, but look at what I'm doing here. I'm just winning this. Easy peasy. I don't know what is going on. Here we go. S single floor still so far. And the last one has Anton Lila Valerie, that's the name. Do they have anything new? Recover two stagger resist on a successful attack. That's pretty cool. Defensive dice power plus one is the same. And when another person dies, recover two HP on a successful attack. Lila's page seems pretty nice. However, one speed die, right? Yeah, they all have one speed die. And two stagger resist on Anton's page again. Damn, Lila seems pretty strong though. I can't wait to give this to someone. Okay, let's just try. Are we gonna focus on the regular air sweepers or... Here we go, let's get rid of these. Um, no one is attacking Harry so far. We're gonna focus on this one since Harry can take over here. With a good old repressed flash. And then we're gonna go puppet blockade on him as well. Let's see what, what the other people will do. I'm just gonna go all out again. <laughs> it doesn't matter, I think. Then again, if we can win some easy clashes here and get them to bleed, why the hell not, right? Same here. Same here. Okay, Harry needs to take over again, and let's see this first turn play out. Okay, so far so good. I do like the nature of this game that you can just queue up moves and it's gonna play out before you. And you can just watch and be in awe at either your retardation or your absolute Sun Tzu kind of tactical um, ingenuity. <laughs> Here we go. He's almost dead. Is he gonna die? Uh, okay, the, the effect triggered. But that's it's not too bad. We can start working on another one, another uh, on another one immediately by I think doing this or this. We want to start working on that's a regular sweep. Okay, let's get rid of the regular sweepers first. Let's do. Let's do this. 
but not forget about this one, if possible. We're gonna guard against most of the stuff, don't worry. I don't know why I have cooking prep in here. <laughs> it must be because it has a pierce die, and the 4-4 seems kind of strong, to be honest. But other than that, I'm not entirely sure about it. Okay, the Crack of Dawn would be pretty good. Okay, that should be enough to kill it. I think there's four attacks going out on the staggered one. Good, good, Harry, good. Ah, oh, the attacks, when they go off a few times in a row and they get a plus health on every attack. That's devastating. Oh, yeah, he's dead, okay. I'm sorry, dear neighbors, don't make me feel for you. Stop it. I don't want to be sad right now. I'm sad enough already with my life as it is. Oh, Harry doesn't have any light, what happened here? So who are we gonna focus on next? This one, I guess, right? The regular one, I said. Let's guard against this. And... Let's... Guard against this as well, I guess? Let's do a little bit of a recovery turn, where we try to guard against stuff. At least. And Harry's not gonna do anything, apparently. So in the grand scheme of things, this might be a lost turn, since I'm not gonna deal a lot of damage to them. Wasn't too bad. Wasn't too bad. Um, and neither is this, really. Neither is this. We're gonna react with Harry here. Okay. Oh, I want to clash with this. I'm gonna do that. Let's see if this works out. We still have enough stagger to just take a few attacks like this. Here we go. This one is staggered. I didn't even pay attention to the resistance types and stuff. This this feels way too easy compared to... I mean, maybe I just didn't understand what I was supposed to do with the Knight of Despair. Maybe that's a problem. But even the she has felt harder than this. I guess this is a persistence fight where you have to fight a lot of them at once, so it's kind of hard in this sense. But generally, seems easy. Seems pretty easy right now. Hmm. Nah, we're not gonna bother with that. Just gonna take it. Here we go. Down to 17. Work a little bit on him. Down to three. Okay, he's dead. Oh no, his effect trigger. Well, whatever. Doesn't matter too, too much. Because we can... Oh, full light on Harry. Oh, but we can't use two pages, sadly. They're all free cost. We're gonna draw something. We're gonna go strong with this one. Five to thirteen. Um, and try to focus on this guy at the same time. So he's attacking Mark of here. Crack of Dawn his ass. Uh, Transpierce this ass. I'm doing a lot of things with a lot of asses today. I'm very sorry if you're offended. Yeah, let's try it out. Let's see if Harry will be enough to kill this other one. Not quite. Not quite. Am I jeopardizing this right now? They have a lot of light now, apparently. Ooh. I'm not sure I'm doing the right thing anymore. Let's see. No, no, no. This is gonna kill him. He has persistence again! What the crap? Stop using that card! Hmm. Who is he actually attacking? Uh, oh, we're, react we're reacting here with this. Okay. Am I not doing anything here so far? 
Do I want to flash the sun up? Flash off sun up even? Or red notes? Let's do this. Let's draw a page instead. Okay, this one. Please die. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake, he got the effect again. Okay, how many can he have, though? He had three, right? Oh shit, Malkov's nearly staggered, I think. And so is Nicole. Man, I love the fact that they can attack so many times in a row. I'm pretty sure there's some ways to break the game. If you keep doing that. Oh shit, we need to take this over. Otherwise Malkov will be staggered. I have no zero cost cards on, on Harry. What is going on? Alright. We might have to whip out another floor here. If we're fucking this up anymore. And if this guy gets any more lucky as well. <laughs> yeah. Now Nicole is staggered. I love it when Harry clashes. There's no way in hell they can beat Harry. Harry alone could defeat these guys, I think. Okay, that's good. Again. It's another good one. Um, any big attacks we want to block? I'm gonna do this. And then this. Okay. No one else needs to do anything anymore, guys. Harry got it. Harry got it all. Or does he? Yeah, he kinda does. And we might not want to do anything here. Does he? <laughs> yes! Yes, he does. Okay, he got it. He got it all under control. Thank you, Harry. Doesn't matter that Malkov is staggered. Wait, did she get staggered earlier? <laughs> oh no, it was Nicole. Of course, okay. Okay, now the big guy is staggered. Uh, oh man, I want to use this on a good one. Malkov might die, but let's be honest, who cares if one of us dies. We can bring them back better than before. Big one is almost down as well. Will most likely die this turn if they don't get persistence. Which they do. <laughs> they do get persistence here. But that's okay. It's okay. Harry is gonna take over all of the clashes again, if possible. Except for this one. And we're gonna focus on big guy again. Let's see if we can kill him twice in that time. Ooh, we didn't win a, a, a clash? Are you serious? Here we go. I feel like this is a lot of combat in today's episode, and I'm not sure if I will cut it out or not, so you might get to see it all. Which is kind of weird. I don't usually do it like that. Who is he attacking? Ah, oh, man, Nicole is constantly starved on light, it seems. So is Harry this time. Okay, this guy might die, though. Let's hope for the best. It's not good. It's not good. It's not good. He... Well, he didn't die yet. <laughs> he might die now, if we're lucky. Let's just... Wait. No, 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 no. I'd rather draw a page. It's gonna interrupt him if he dies, right? That's how it should work. Let's see. Uh, some Searing Sword action. Yeah. So, did he die or not? What? what?
I'm taking a lot of time to kill just this big guy. I don't know what is going on. Is it because I'm too cocky, not wanting to commit all of my resources on one of them? It must be. It must be my fault. It's always my fault, let's be honest. It's always my fault. So let's commit a lot of resources to him now. As, at least as many resources as we can, which is not a lot. It's not a lot at all. At least Harry is, like, carrying us so far. Okay, um, he's not allowed to get any more persistence, please. Ah, uh, yes, okay, good, good. We need to get rid of him now. Oh, god damn it. You know what, we're gonna take this over and do this. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Um, no, how, how are we gonna do that? That should kill him, honestly. If this doesn't kill the big guy, I don't know what is wrong with me. Or oh, the fight. Here we go. A stagger at least. That's success. Okay, he's staggered as well. He's not gonna die, again. <laughs> what the crap, he's down to 1 HP. Is he gonna die next turn at least? Please, same as this guy. Not if I kill him now, I guess. Uh, wait. Let's make sure he dies right now. Let's let's <laughs> let's spread our resources again, shall we? That works so well usually. Spreading thin, like having a toast and just a tiny bit of marmalade. You have to spread it all across the toast so you taste nothing at all in the end, instead of just eating the marmalade and then some dry toast. Mmm, yes, yes, let's see. We're either killing all three of them at once or none of them. <laughs> oh no, if it if it starts next scene, or at the end of the scene that they heal up, we are killing all three of them now. That was a weird turn. That was a weird turn. Victory. Curtain call for the reception of sweepers. That took me a long time. It shouldn't have taken that long. This will be the whole episode. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I shouldn't apologize for that, but... Oh, cool. We got a gift. Oh, that's a lot of pages. Oh, is this the new encounter you do when you want to level up, I guess? Damn. Boy, was that exhausting. Those sweepers sure are persistent. What kind of deal could have made them so desperate, I wonder? The most I can tell is that the sweepers are losing their ground, so they try to make a deal to do something about it. Could we get to know more? No idea. Maybe the invitation will show us the answer eventually. You seem to be weirdly fixed on the sweepers, by the way. What's up with that? Something about them smelled suspicious. Did it? <laughs> Did I shit my pants? They do have an awful smell, I give you that. Take a sniff of those filthy bandages and your appetites. Are you insane? <laughs> well, sheesh, can't even crack a joke. <laughs> well, anyway, this is the first time our Miss Library director let her intuition speak so much. I guess it won't hurt to keep an eye on this case. Because that's what I am. I'm a fucking gimp. Let's play the gacha. Uh, I might have to revisit some decks soon, I think. Maybe I'm gonna do that as soon as I get through the current content though, because then I will have everything available again. I didn't do that last time, right? I'm not using any... <laughs> I'm not using anything from the She Office so far, at least not that I know. I mean, Roland is using it a little bit because I didn't fiddle with his deck at all. I swear to god, I didn't fiddle with Roland's deck. Um, but yeah, whatever. Whatever, I'm gonna stop for now. Bye everyone, I hope you enjoyed the sweepers. Uh, don't, don't let them bite you on your way out. <laughs>